Finally, you're actually awake. Welcome to my laboratory. Although I seem to have a little bit of more side effects going on with me and my newfound ability. But I can't let that get in my way. You see, my newfound powers have given me quite an upgrade of some sort. But I decided to ease down on using my quirk for a little bit, because look at me. It's deteriorating me. It's tearing me apart every time I use just it once. But, and according to my plans, everything is going quite orderly. Including capturing you. Because, well, you're restraint on this table of sorts. Because you are the lead of my new Nomu I'm going to be creating. You see, I needed someone like you. I need something powerful. And you're exactly what I'm looking for. Your quirk. It's something of a remindance of who I had to face in the past. Someone who can double in their size. Someone who can double in their strength. So, you're perfect. I'm going to be taking every single part of you to be putting inside of my new Numu. You're perfect. But seeing you is making my skin crawl. <laughs> it's making me remind myself of those old days where my old master tried to distract me from who and what I want to be. But well, that's not going to stop me anymore. Those distractions are no longer needed. Those distractions are no longer needed for what I need. I want to rebuild. I want to rebuild a new civilization where you can do whatever and whenever. But I want to lead this new world. I want it to be my own playground. And I'm almost done building my army. I'm almost done building this army to help me. My new Nomu will tear down this world and make it into something that I can mold into, like a piece of clay. But I know with all good pieces of art made of clay, you need to be careful with it, otherwise it might decay and break, even within your grasps. You need a structured settlement to build something upon it. So you are perfect for what I need. You are going to be my lead Nomu. You are going to be my lead experiment. As soon as I get your blood, your organs, your heart, and your brain functioning inside one of my new normal bodies, 
You'll be untouchable. You'll be unstoppable. <laughs> You'll be my lead of my new army. Well, one of my new leads in my army. You see, I know you've been already treated correctly by my new co-founders, Izuku and Overhaul. I know you've been treated well by them because I can see it on your body. <laughs> You've been captured, tortured, shot with a quirk-stunning bullet. But my type of quirk-stunning bullets, they're a bit more effective. Sure, they might put you to sleep. But once you wake up, you can't use your quirk anymore. Extracting that blood out of your DNA will help my new move reach higher calibers of destruction. You're perfect. You've been told you're nothing but an insect. You've been told that you are nothing compared to everyone. But I think you're something. I think you're something real special. Special to me, that is. You're special in your own ways. Because you are useful for me. You are perfect. <laughs> Enough of the chit chat. It's time to start my experimenting. Oh, but it starts of draining your blood from your body. You see, I've already had these needles injected inside of you. They're just waiting to suck up the blood from your veins. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing, hero. I'm not just going to be taking a little bit of your blood. I'm taking all of it. You see, all I need is your organs and your blood. I don't need your body. All I need is the functions that your body has. To make my new lead Nomu function the way they are supposed to be. But of course, I said I needed your brain. And your brain will function the same way. But it will function in the way I need it to. Because I'm taking only a part of your lobe to use it on my Nomo. <laughs> I hope you're ready to be experimented and torn apart. <laughs> because I'm ready to tear you apart. Nerve by nerve. To make you my own. You are my new Frankenstein monster. And call me Dr. Frankenstein. Because I am going to be using you for my own good. <laughs> Be a good experiment and go under. Have a nice sleep. And you'll wake up.
friend.